Hello friends, today I am going to show you how to stream updates with HTML5 server sent events. Now, what is HTML5 SSE? HTML5 SSE allows us to stream updates from the web server. This is very useful or very helpful in updating updates like market, uh, the rate of markets and uh, live scores, etc, etc. So, for this, we have our index page. Here my scorecard, the IV ID score, where the score would be shown. The next, my score.php, which will fetch the score inserted into our database. Or update.php, which will allow me to uh, set the uh, set the scores. Here is my uh, database SSE, my table live and my data id and score i have already set the score so first uh, we start with our score.php for sse the first thing we need to set is two headers that is um, header content type that is text slash uh, event event stream text slash event stream the next header is cache control cache control to set no control these are two most important headers or else SSE will not work so I am defining a variable connection that my SQLI connect my lo local host root there is no password and uh, our database SSE the next is the query Query is set to uh, uh, select all uh, uh, from uh, live. Yeah, it is yeah live. Select all from live. The output would be uh, the result would be uh, my SQL query. And dollar out put will be a MySQL So now the next part we need to echo. Remember using these to uh, double dot. First, what we want to send to the uh, from SSE is it should start with data, with the uh, with the colon. And uh, thing uh, what we want is uh, here I would be data score, and the ending of our data comes with slash n slash n. That is a new line. So if you want to uh, another line, you could have used uh, if your data contains more than one line, then the first line should be separated with uh, one single slash n, and uh, the ending would be slash n and slash n. So uh, we have only one line. That's enough, and the ending is flush, as we want it to go to the right. So we are uh, done with our score.php. The next thing is update.php. We are taking back our connection. Okay. First thing is post. Uh, then it would be uh, the score in the score through post.
I've already uh, made the form as a post input type text name score input type sum in. The next thing is uh, the query part. Uh, we are now updating update uh, live set uh, score is equals to dollar score where id is equals to one the next one my sql i query Uh, both the scripts are ready. The next thing is our Java, JavaScript that will uh, SSC JavaScript. So first uh, we start with uh, defining a variable source. So first we are starting with uh, setting a variable source that is new event source. Here it goes uh, from which PHP file or uh, which page we are getting the updates. It, uh, so it is score, uh, source or scores score score dot php the next part <coughs> source on message on message we will call a function <coughs> the parameter event We now we will be selecting uh, this uh, div element with score. So document docu dot uh, get uh, by id that is score dot uh, inner h html would be event dot data so we are ready with, with everything let's check it if there is no problem so let's check it out so here it's already done uh, I will open uh, another private window localhost slash ssv update dot php uh, so I'm in, entering 89 see here it's changed 669 it's changed Okay, so this was our today's tutorial. Thanks for watching.